waiting in the lounge. I done had to move a few pounds. Looking at my chain, don't drown. Andy put the diamonds in his mouth. All bad bitch pop out. When a nigga stepping at the house. Every day we walk the red curb. Every day one of my hoes falling in love. Drop that top, get up, breathe. Oh. Got four million in jury, oh. Let that money fly to the ceiling, whoa. Did you pay someone's tuition? No. Do you own a store? No. Yeah, fuck all that bullshit. Diamonds for all us kings, yeah. Got my money went ludicrous. Get some rest of a hood, bitch. Get some rest of a poor pit. Look at the grain. What up, it's Bay, and I'm back with another video. And I know I've been gone for a long time. I have been going through some stuff. personal stuff. Some other stuff, just stuff. I just been going through stuff and you know how that go. I'm coming back with this little hair review. Well, should I call this the initial review or yeah, I guess this is like initial review because I just installed it last night. So yeah. I'm sorry I couldn't get footage of it fresh out the box, but yeah, we just gonna um, jump right into this little initial hair review. Okay, so this hair that I purchased, this is not a sponsored video, so yeah. But this hair that I purchased is called Elva Hair, and I got it from AliExpress. It's a AliExpress vendor, and I've never purchased any hair from this company before on AliExpress. I have purchased hair from other companies on AliExpress, but I've never tried Elva hair, but honestly, off rip, y'all, this hair is bomb as fuck. Like, I don't know how to even really give it all its credit. Like, I really can't even describe how good this hair is. It's, it's just so bomb. Like, hands down, hands the fuck down, this hair is the best hair that I've ever got, that I've ever purchased, that I've ever 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 so my hair came in this box and it just says elva something something elva hair products co and yeah this is the box that it came in it's a little yeah it's a little yeah <laughs> i guess that happened through shipping i'm not sure but yeah this is what the box looks like and this is a lace wig. It's not a full lace wig. It's only lace in the front. And I'll show you how the lace is. Okay. So all of this right here is lace. And then like all of this is lace. So yeah. And then there's lace in the back if you want to pull it up in a ponytail. This hair is Brazilian. Um, I believe Brazilian straight if I'm not mistaken I think it was the Brazilian straight and I got it in 22 inches and when I tell y'all this is like super true to length like honestly it feels longer than 22 inches like I'm five one and a half and usually usually 22 inches don't go to my butt i don't know like i don't know like i've gotten i've had 24 inch hair before i've had 26 i've had 28 and but 28 i had that in curly so i never straightened it but 24 and 26 i've had in straight hair and 24 and 26 definitely touched my butt but i don't think i've ever had 22 inches that literally like touches my butt and I mean it's not it's there like it's there it's just the bottom of the hair it like touches like the like the middle of my butt like towards the middle of my butt so I'm like this seems more of like a 24 inch in my opinion but that's good because it's better to have more than less right the more the merrier right yes so True to length, um, true to density. I don't even know what density I got, honestly, but I'm just saying it's true to density because 
I mean, it's full enough. Like, it's nice and full. It is full enough to my liking. I received the hair yesterday around 2.30. And I, auto I immediately started prepping my um, lace slash frontal, whatever you want to call it. Um, I bleached the knots. I plucked it a little bit because the wig, oh yeah, the wig also came pre-plucked with baby hairs because I hate plucking and I've only had one other frontal before so I ain't no frontal fanatic and I don't know all of that. I'm not used to frontals. This is only my second frontal and that's why I'm surprised that I actually did really good on it. But um, I really don't really be feeling like doing all that plucking so when it said that it came pre-plugged I was like wonderful like that is great because then i don't have to do that much work and i really didn't have to and as you can see my hairline looks so freaking natural and i barely plucked it like literally i spent like five minutes on plucking usually usually like when i be watching these other um youtubers and they be plucking their frontal they be taking like 30 minutes to pluck their frontal and stuff and I don't be having time like that to be plucking a frontal. Like, that's just really time consuming. And so, this came pre-plucked, so we lit. So, yes. So, let me just go through the pros and some cons about this wig. So, I'm going to just start off with the pros. The pros of this wig is it's the softest hair I've ever felt. Like, this is the softest hair I've ever had, ever felt. It's soft. Like, it is so soft. And you can see my hands is gliding through it. Like, it's just gliding through the hair. Like, what? My hands is gliding through this hair. Like, no tangles at all. Another pro about this hair, listen, I don't watch reviews. I've watched reviews. I've looked at reviews on AliExpress with this hair. And I just, I always, I'm very, very, very particular about the hair that I purchase. You will never, ever, ever catch me purchasing no cheap ass, weak ass weave, period. Um, so... I'm very particular about the hair that I purchase and I'm I'm very particular about what I spend my money on. So, you know, I had to make sure that it was legit. So I looked at like every single review and mind you, there's like not thousands but hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of reviews and I literally I went through like a lot of them like like I went through like half of the reviews because I just had to make sure. So the review, a lot of the reviews were saying that it had a lot of shedding, blah, blah, blah. Y'all, when I tell you I've experienced minimal shedding, like, there's not even a strand on my hand. Y'all see that? I just, I just raked my hands through this hair. No shedding. So I don't know, maybe they had a bad batch or I don't know. I don't know what the fuck they got going on, but I know that this hair that I got on my head right now does not shed like that. Like, when I first took the wig out of the pack and I ran my hands through it, I did get, like, a couple strands. But I ain't never been that caught up on shedding, you know? Like, a little shedding ain't nothing to me. Like, I really don't care about, you know, a little bit of shedding. Now, if it was OD, then yeah, I would have a problem with that. But literally, this wig don't shed... Um, you might see a strand on your kitchen, not kitchen, what am I talking about? You might see a strand on your bathroom counter, like a strand or two, but this hair does not shed like that. So that is a big plus, even though I don't care that much about shedding it. Like if I had a little bit more shedding, I still wouldn't be that, you know, caught up on it. But the fact that it doesn't is even greater, so... Another pro about this hair, like I said, the density, great density, the length, true to length. Um, 
the lace was so was really really easy to bleach like it didn't give me no problems no trouble um what else what else um just the closure is just bomb like the closure the frontal the frontal is just bomb like um i like i said i've had a frontal before and um it was trash it was really trash and i'm i'm ashamed that i even shared that hair i mean like the bundles was fine it was just the frontal that they had sent me the frontal was trash the bundles was good and um I did recommend that hair to some people only because they were asking me like where I got it from and I've never been the type of bitch to be selfish about where I get certain things from like the fuck. I want to see, I want to see other females win like if like say that I, I just um purchased this wig I've already been getting so many compliments on it so many people have been asking me where I got it from etc da 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 and I'm telling you, I've told every single female what wig it is, like all the specs, gave them all the specs, where I got it from, everything. Like, I ain't never been that type of bitch that was selfish and, you know, didn't want to share, you know, where I get goodies from. Like, you know, I'm not that type of bitch. I'm just not. It was, sorry, I was reading something. But this front tool, this front tool is bomb. There's no bald spots in it. Didn't come with no bald spots in it. It didn't come with no sparse areas in it. Um, it just came like, y'all see how like at loss for words I am? Like this shit is crazy. But I'm so glad that I purchased this hair. Um, it is Elva hair on AliExpress and um, let's go to the cons now. There's not a lot of cons about this hair. I will tell you that right now. Like as you can see, the review has just been super, super good so far. One thing about the hair is like the end is kind of poofy. The end is kind of poofy. Um, well, if you can tell but the end is kind of poofy but that's really just a personal problem of mine like I'm pretty sure a whole lot of people don't really even care about that but me you know like when I first took the hair out of the pack the ends weren't poofy but of course because I had to bleach the knots blah 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 I had to wash it condition do all that extra shit then blow dry and straighten it and so yeah the ends are a little poofy on it but that's cool like that's not even a big deal that's just really a personal problem for me but it's not really a problem you know it's just a little it's just i don't know i mean maybe if i put a serum on the ends of it maybe that could help um but i don't really like putting product in my weave like i literally don't put no product in my weave ever because i hate how products weigh down your hair so i never put products in my weave and that's how my weave just be so flowy and so luscious and just moving all over the place oh yeah and another thing was it's very very flyaway it's very very flyaway but like i said some type of hairspray or hair sheen whatever that could probably minimize the flyaways and stuff like that but literally this this wig is bomb i really like that's really it um i'll put the information below in the description box if you guys are interested and i'm i'm pretty sure that you guys will be interested i mean look at it look at it no cocky shit no cocky shit but just honestly like take my face off and just look at the frontal like get close up on it like y'all this hair bomb as fuck period and also last but not least the well of course i didn't get bundles so you can't look at the west but like there's no short strands on this wig nowhere 
like it's just so full and luscious and honestly i probably will be ordering well i will be ordering from them again and this wig cost me only 188 and something cents but 188 it was free shipping i got it through dhl and y'all know dhl bomb as fuck because I've been saying bomb as fuck throughout this whole video and that's crazy. Like, that's really crazy. Just how wonderful this whole situation is. DHL is lit because day packages literally be coming like three, four, five days. It, it'll get to you. Like, this hair got to me in five days. It got to me in five days and yesterday, it came yesterday and yesterday was Thursday. We all know that on Sundays, the mail don't run. So, you know, that's one extra day that nothing's being done. So, if you just take one day off of that, four days. Four days. It was free shipping, like I said. And that is it. Like, I'm going to wrap up this hair review. And thank you guys so much for watching. I know I've been going, but I'm coming back and I'm... I really want to like get into the vlogging. My life ain't really that interesting, but you know, a girl can try. So I'm going to try to vlog and we'll see how that goes. But yeah, so make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see y'all in my next video.